Divine Souls, published by Any.TV, coming soon. Have you ever wanted an MMO that isn't just full of tab targeting? An MMO where you can get your fists on people and really dish out the punishment? Then Divine Souls is for you. This is the brawler class. He runs around, punches things in the face with a big lump of metal on his arm. You don't get much cooler than that. With our system, he also does combos. Look out for the stomach punch combo coming up soon and the high kick. With his abilities, he can stun lock enemies for minutes at a time while he dishes out the hurt in all sorts of ways. Now for the mage class. <coughs> look at her, look at how attractive she is. But she's not just the pretty face, our mage can kick ass, both in melee and ranged combat. With a large arsenal of attacks such as fireballs, big AoE blasts and hammer hits, she is a real badass and a real force to be reckoned with. And with the mobility such as teleports, dodge rolls, all sorts of things, she can get out of any situation with ease. Look as she runs and then dives in for a whirling blade, it doesn't get much cooler than that. And here we go with the ultimate. Now we're into our slasher class. You want to play a female that can take any man on with a sword, this is the chick for you. Not only is it so a sword, it's also a chain wing. Watch, watch how she takes on combat. Our slasher is really designed to dish out punishment to multiple enemies at a time with a large, large arc on her swings. A little mistake there where the boss picks her up on his spear and throws her down, but watch as she gets up and slashes the shit out of everything. And here we go with the ultimate, a large chain whip attack that brings spikes from the ground. And now we have our healer, the priest. He's a bit of a pretty boy, but don't let that fool you. With that scythe on his back and his large large arcs in his swings, he can take on most things without issue. Here we see the priest dimming, dishing out punishment to large amounts of enemies. He's, also, he's a support class, but he can also kick some ass, and he's one of the only classes that have got large damage over time, such as poisons. If you're looking for a healer that can get in there and kick it with the best of them, then our healer's for you. Hey guys, how you doing? I'm Scalper Hero, and this is my video on Divine Souls. This this game is not in its beta release at all. It used to be in 2010, but the publisher messed up on it. The I think I'm not really sure what it was that messed up. I think it was the actual game itself. But never mind about that. Now there's a new publisher on it, which is Any.TV. They are a they do have a website, there will be a link in the description to them. So yeah guys, sorry, <laughs> I'm trying to say, I'm trying to keep out a certain word, so if I pause a little bit you'll have to forgive about that. First off, I did ask them a load of questions, because I'm with YT Gamers and they are teaming up with us. and. So I was able to get a lot of questions. I am allowed to use this video, 
uh, I did have their permission about it. Also, so I asked them a lot of questions, and I'm gonna give a, I'm gonna give the information to you guys so you know what's coming and what's not. First off, I did ask them if there were any different cities and towns. Uh, apparently, there are a load of um, areas to explore in the game. <coughs> There will be updates for the game as well, uh, as time goes on, so that's pretty cool. Um, there will be different classes. Uh, as you know, uh, there is a guy that be that's before my video, uh, telling you about the classes and whatnot. I d I, all I did was take his video and um, what is that? Uh, loop it round. So yeah, it makes it easier for me. That way, you got both views on it. You got his side of the information and mine. Next up is it will be a free-to-play game. I did ask him if you'd have to pay if it will start off as a free-to-play, and if we would uh, have to have to pay a monthly thing at a later date. He said no, the game will be free to play, so I'm guessing it's at all times. <coughs> I also asked him um, how how long this game had been being developed for. It's been getting developed for quite a while. They've been working on it for a long time. He couldn't give us he couldn't give me a, exact dates on it. So sorry if that's a bit less information for you guys. There are PvP and PvE, such as dungeons and player vs player, obviously. I don't know if you'll be able to sell some gear in an auction house or not, so I'll have to I'll have to wait for his answer on that one. If uh, I get an answer today, I will post the answer in the description for you guys. Uh, also, I asked him on my last question. Oh, sorry. Uh, my f my tenth question to him was, what would be the starting place be like? Apparently, he told me that it would be the starting town is pretty beautiful and pretty unique. Something unique is what I'm really looking forward to. I'm used to World of Warcraft a lot, so I've seen like nearly everything. My last question to him was, will the be hotkeys? Uh, apparently there will be uh, well that's all the time I've got guys I uh, hope you enjoyed this video peace